So my name is Prasant, I'm from India. I did a foundation studies in the business and IT stream at La Trobe College Australia in 2018 and then I went on to do a Bachelor of Cyber Security at La Trobe Uni. Uh, and then looking at the entry requirements, I wasn't able to meet the entry requirements for the course uh, straight away. So I had to go through a foundation program at La Trobe College Australia and that's how I, I came to know um, uh, LTCA. And the foundation program really helped me to sort of hone all the skills I needed for university even before I started university. So things like academic communication, academic writing, uh, or just how to write a paper. So those kind of essential skills that really uh, is needed at university. I was able to learn that well before I started university. So that sort of gave me a head start and I was also able to meet my entry requirements for the degree. So during my time at university, I sort of uh, didn't look a lot into um, getting a job in the first year of university or even when I was doing foundation studies. So it really started off using all the resources that, that were provided to me from second year of university. So I used things like um, the Lefrope Career Hub's um, industry mentoring program that, that patches you up with a, an industry mentor for about 12 weeks. And sort of uh, I worked with them to sort of understand the discipline further, I look at the job opportunities, how to get a job in Australia, and sort of even simplistic things like um, how to build out your resume. And, and sort of that provided me a lot of industry exposure, I should say. Uh, and then sort of slowly moving, and even before that, when I finished foundation, or I think, I think a couple of months before I finished foundation, I was offered to work as a peer learning mentor at Lefrop College. And that sort of prepared me for an industry job as well. So I was learning things like how to work as a team, how to, how to communicate professionally, how to write professionally again. So, and then I was part of the La Trobe College Australia's um, academic board as well as a student representative. So uh, that, was a, that was heaps of exposure provided to me uh, during my time both at La Trobe College Australia and at La Trobe uh, University. So through all these resources and mentoring, um, I was able to secure a position as an associate cybersecurity consultant uh, in Melbourne. During my time at Foundation as well, one of the biggest benefits of studying at LTCA was the personal relationships I was able to build with my uh, tutors and lecturers. So, and for example, the subject that I just mentioned earlier, academic communication, that helps me till date in my professional um, work as well. So, and I was able to mentor in that subject. I was able to work for that subject as a peer learning mentor after I finished it. And that sort of always kept my uh, skills up to date. Yeah. So about a year and a half uh, into Australia, I finished foundation, I went on to university and then the COVID, COVID lockdown hit and then snap lockdowns, uh, 20 months away from family, didn't get to see any of them. Um, so that sort of really took a toll uh, on myself academically. Uh, it was very challenging to, to sort of move from a traditional face-to-face -face learning to the online mode of study. But then we again had um, the university resources as well to help out um, with those things as well. So I'd say uh, the isolation and, and the COVID lockdowns were a very big challenge, but more broadly speaking, it was um, the living alone factor that sort of is really hard. Uh, but I'm more of a Briani fan, so I don't know how much I can speak to, uh, to doses, but uh, I'd say, Taste of Chennai, just down Funny Road, is a good place that you might want to try. So, and it's near the university as well. So one of the biggest opportunities that I got uh, while studying at La Trobe College Australia was being able to represent the student body at the academic board level. And that gave me the chance to voice student concerns, just engage with the community. And it also sort of helped me professionally on how to communicate professionally, how to write uh, documents, how to write corporate documents, basically. And um, that sort of contributed to my industry exposure as well from a soft skill point of view.